Well, the fish aren't biting today, so might as well give you a tour of my new fishing station. Made this one myself, designed it myself, um, sourced all the parts myself, and uh, based on the previous one that I'd, uh, I'd made out of parts from uh, Jim at Matchbox. Um, but this is all aluminium, it's much, much lighter. It all folds up, you don't take anything apart, it just all twists and swivels and folds flat. And um, I'll give you a little bit of a guided tour. So the rod is on a couple of rod rests, as you can see. They're clipped on here by these clips. So you can clip them off, clip them on, and push them up to any height you want, front and rear. The legs themselves are all um, walking, walking sticks that I've adapted. So these little buttons here, uh, you can change the position and heighten the whole thing. I've got it uh, not high, but halfway up at the moment to get over this handrail. But when you're in the water, it's usually lower than that. Um, built into it. I've got some spirit levels so I can tell when I'm in the water if I'm level or not. I've put some labels on it because actually it's a bit difficult once it's all folded up to understand which way it goes around when you unfold it. Uh, the tray itself is a full one piece aluminium tray and it clips on so using the same clips here to snap on and um, yeah, it's turned out very well. I've added an um, umbrella a tube here. I haven't got an umbrella at the moment, but that's where it'll go. So when it goes there, it'll cover the whole tray. And when I'm standing in this area here, and um, yeah, I'm very, very pleased with it. I'm gonna do a bit of work on my landing net handle, because sometimes I want it in front of me and sometimes I want it along the bank like at the moment. So I've got to work out something on the top of these legs here. And cup that and hook that. As you can see at the moment, it's a, it's a cup here. There's a cup there. And then the other thing I'm going to work out is when I'm fishing this peg, um, my landing net actually goes underneath the bottom of the handrail here because it's three metres off the water. Um, but when I'm in the water, um, that is going to go into this here, which this pivots, and it actually helps. When you fold the whole thing up, you, fold, um, you turn that down, and it keeps it all together so you can carry it easy. So yeah, um, first time out. It's worked exactly as I wanted it to. Absolutely perfect on dry ground. I think it might be a bit fiddly um, adjusting the, uh, the heights of the legs when it's in the water because you have to press those little brass buttons in and move it around. But the good news is you can do that before you put anything on it. So the you leave the tray on the bank with all the stuff, um, put the frame in the water, get the legs right, check the levels, make sure everything's how you want it and then bring the tray over, snap it on the top, put all your stuff on the tray. So overall, very pleased. Just a shame that there's no fish today. <laughs>